on the road again after eating lunch. We're uh, just ate lunch in uh, Snowflake and heading towards Cholo, Arizona. Um, and uh, up on the rim, we're at about uh, probably about 6,000 feet elevation right now. Um, up on the mountain, and uh, so we we went in to get something to eat, and uh, Kyle. Kyle seems to have be mastering the uh, highway driving really good, but we haven't really been practicing city driving and around the block and stuff. So um, uh, we we start to pull in to the restaurant and uh, we kind of we're going a little too fast. So I asked Kyle to slow down and and we kill, he killed it. So then he had to start it back up and get going. So he pulled it on. I'm very good at starting the car now. Yep. He, Every time I start perfectly. He's getting very good at starting the stick shift and getting it going. Um, but then we pulled on around the parking lot and we pulled into the space and and uh, first. and uh, it seemed like everything was going fine except uh, we were getting near the curb and the edge to the drop off and as we got within about two feet I kind of yelled at him to slam on the brakes. He, thought he had the brake on, but he didn't, so we came to an abrupt halt just inches before death. Well, actually, there was a curb there. Probably would have just destroyed the car some, but we uh, we got the car stopped okay and uh, rolled it back a little bit off the curb, and then we went in to eat, and Kyle was telling me how great a parking job he did without... Uh, Except that he forgot to stop, and I was saying, "Well, yeah, okay, whatever. You know, stopping is pretty important." And uh, so we walk back out to the car, and we look at the car, and it's all crooked in the space and everything. And so, and my stance was crooked. Okay, well, so we have a little bit of practice to go on on uh, stopping and city driving, but highway driving, Kyle seems to be uh, doing pretty good right now.